I was really curious to check out Enchanted Tea Party. This is the second volume in the Disney Princess Sing Along Song series, and the first volume was amazing. But I feel like they'd included pretty much all of the key princess songs. So I was very keen to find out what ones were in volume two and also volume three, but I'll get there uh, eventually. And I have to say, the song selection, while not quite as good as the first volume, understandably, it's still pretty decent. And I will, as always, go through the songs. I will share some personal highlights. There were definitely some songs in this that I couldn't remember, songs that were not that familiar, but there were also some songs that I thought were pretty good. This was released in 2005 for context, just in case you want to try and guess which songs feature in this before I talk through them. And that is what I'll do now. So it starts off with a Cinderella song, So This Is Love, a classic that I could have guessed was in this. And then we have... Kiss the Girl from The Little Mermaid, which is another one that definitely feels like it belongs in here. Then we have Forget About Love with Jasmine from The Return of Jafar. I have seen The Return of Jafar, but it's not a song I recognize. I don't know it very well at all. So there was no singing along for me there. Then we have Something There from Beauty and the Beast. And I don't know how I feel about this song. I feel like it fits in very well with this collection. Sometimes I hear it and I think, yeah, this is a really brilliant song. And sometimes it irritates me. Today, I didn't mind it. At the end of my discussion for Volume 1, I did a couple of predictions for songs that I thought might be in this. And we have one of those songs, Just Around the Riverbend from Pocahontas, which I love. That's such a brilliant classic song. We then have Someday My Prince Will Come from Snow White, which is another one that really definitely belongs in here. And I don't think I guessed that one, but certainly if I'd thought about it for longer, that one might have come up. And the same for the next one, which is I Wonder from Sleeping Beauty. It's not my favourite Sleeping Beauty song, but I, I do like it. Then we have another one that I didn't remember, and this is Honor to Us All from Mulan. And listening to it, it didn't ring any bells. I've seen Mulan, but I could not remember it. And the same for the next few, actually. We have Love from Robin Hood. No recollection, but it's a great film. And In a World of My Own from Alice in Wonderland. To be honest, as great as Alice in Wonderland is as a film, I don't rate the soundtrack very highly. I don't think I care for any of the songs. That's not necessarily to say they're bad songs, but Disney songs are often so amazing, and at least every Disney film has at least a couple of amazing songs. But with that one, I just I don't find it to be that entertaining. We then have For a Moment from The Little Mermaid 2, which is a brilliant film. I've only seen it once, and the soundtrack is not something I remembered very well, so I couldn't sing along to it. But I thought it was a pretty decent song. And then we end with uh, Where Dreams Begin, which is a princess song. So not a bad selection. A couple of songs in there that I think definitely belong in there. They are classics. But now I feel like there can't be any more Disney princess songs left based on when these were released. So I'm definitely really looking forward to the third one to see what songs are in there. But I'll find out when I get there. This may not be as good as Volume 1, but I think that's understandable because Volume 1 did contain pretty much what I consider to be the top Disney princess classic songs of the time. But nevertheless, it's a good collection. Some songs in there that I just could not remember. But either way, I thought it was pretty decent. And if you're a Disney fan, it is worth checking out.